is where you'll be bring your next logical chart. All the information I'm looking for is in the description box down below. And thank you so much for supporting Second City. You do not have to be a Libra resonating with this reading. You can be directly connecting to somebody who has Libra in the astrological chart. You can have Libra somewhere in your astrological chart. You came across this reading and it just resonates for you. You have vision. All right. So you, maybe you're an optometrist or you can wear glasses or you need um, contacts. Okay. Maybe you wear contacts. You also have magic. This is also recognizing the magic within you, that you are a magical being, and really seeing that clearly for yourself. And that your dreams can truly be a reality because you wouldn't have seen it if it couldn't be a reality. Yeah. Lovers. Gemini. You're choosing a lover. Many of you, if you're in a relationship and you are married, that person will not remarry after you pass away and vice versa. If you're single, there's a lover coming into your life that you'll be very compatible with. Okay. Well, the fortune Aquarius, Taurus, Sea of Scorpio, Sagittarius, Ophetius. You see how they're shooting it to basically light the cigarette? This is about risk. It takes risk in order to be, you know, successful in relationship and connection. I'm also seeing an emotional outburst coming. Someone's having an emotional outburst. Okay. You have, if you're in a relationship, there's settling. You could be settling in this relationship and emotionally seeing that. Also, many of you are getting promotion at work. Congratulations, Libra. There is good news coming in for you. There's also a crush being revealed to you if you're single. But if you're in a relationship, you are settling. You're not happy in it. You're settling. There's a lot of unhappy memories in it. There's also some type of child abuse, child neglect. You're not happy. You're also not happy regarding work. There's three people in this relationship, if this is a relationship. There's infidelity and somebody's getting kicked out or you're breaking up like right now, no longer investing in it. There's also a lot of uh, either infertility or jealousy or abuse going on. It's someone's also an absentee mother. There's a lack of truth being told in this relationship, if this is a relationship. There's also a child here that's not someone else's child. There's also a lot of ego. And you or the person you're dealing with could be suicidal. And the reason that the intimacy has died is because whoever you're dealing with was looking for a mother. They weren't looking for a spouse. Yeah. This is settling. There's infidelity going on. And like you've been trying to be very optimistic, Libra, or however you're dealing with this. If you've been in a relationship, I feel like you may have been very vocal about the relationship and now it's humiliating or it's embarrassing, or you've been or you're gonna start to hide the relationship, or you've been hiding the relationship because it is humiliating that it's not working out. Yeah, it, whoever the masculine energy is, is cheating. They're cheating. Or they are like abusive. They're Cancer, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Ephesians, or Libra is in any of those planets. Like Sun and Libra, Rising Sun and Libra. I mean, the list could go on. Okay. Mm, yeah, you're pretending that you're much happier in a relationship than you really are. You're not, you're not happy. Um. There's also some type of child abuse or child neglect going on, and you're not leaving because there's abandonment issues. You're also going to a psychic here. There's also some kind of ghosting going on, Taurus and Mercury. You also miss someone. There's ghosting going on. You're also getting a divorce. I see it legally going in your favor if you are. Mm -hmm. 
whoever you're in a relationship with is ex whoever the masculine energy is they are very competitive with the feminine energy regarding career they don't feel like they're as accomplished um there is some form of infidelity going on they feel the masculine energy feels like they're not getting the recognition they deserve there's also like um You're losing your reputation if you're a feminine energy, okay? You're losing your reputation. And there's also your erectile dysfunction in a relationship. You also could be an athlete. There's a lot of fighting going on and people have stopped talking to you. There's an emotional outburst happening. Yeah. If you're in a relationship, you feel like you can't find anyone better. Okay, that's why you're staying in it. It's like a lack of self-worth. If you are single, you feel like you can't find anyone. Okay. You could be a cardiologist or a surgeon. Um, but the intimacy has died in the relationship because the partner was looking for a mother, not for a spouse. Oh, Libra. Okay. I feel like it, it's about the recognition of what do you want to invest in, Libra? Right? Because it's a shock. freaking shocked. There's at least like five other people involved. Some of you work for yourself. You can also be with someone. Like you can be financially struggling or being connected to this person in a relationship. If you're a feminine, you can be financially struggling being connected to this person. If you're not being practical or you're not buying yourself being connected to this person, they don't see your value. You can be with this person for money if you're a woman. Okay. This has been your reading. Libra, thank you so much. Oh, you can also be like working on your health if you're a woman. Like you can be overweight or you can be like, you know, working on improving on your health. You cannot be feeling very well during this time. You can also be looking at other options if you're in a relationship, but you really can't take them because you're in this relationship. But you looking at other options. So I can't take them because I'm in this relationship. So that's what you're thinking. That's what's going on, like, yeah. This is what your partner's thinking. This is what's going on, okay? And just like in life. <laughs> some of you are no longer, or some of you could be working a night shift, okay? That's what you're reading. Oh, there's also a secret being revealed. Ashe.